Alright guys, um, the first time we tried to shoot a video, it didn't save. So, hi, I'm gonna play some C, Joe's yearbook, and it is snowing hard. So, here are items, we add a lot of new ones, and we'll yeah, be- Yeah, Mario Kart 9 Part 3 items. And so we'll be explaining what the items do. So first yeah, up- we, Yeah, we already read the items in our last video. Let's go up it, with- It didn't save, but uh, we're gonna go over how the, the items- and special More, items. But yeah, j let's start off with the regular items that everyone can use. So we have the shell, the green shell, red shell, boo, chain chomp from Double Dash, banana, star, the lightning, mushroom, poison mushroom, which is basically a new item we came up with. It's it was, in, it was an enemy exclusive in Super Mario Kart. Yes, but now everyone's using it. So basically, it'll drop behind you. Um... Basically, it's going to be replacing the fake item box, but it'll drop behind you, and if an uh, enemy gets hit by it, then you get a tiny boost of speed. Yeah, but, and, and, and it could project, uh, it could block projectiles. Yeah, I, I was going to say it could block items, I'm like yeah. a fake item box. Yeah. The blue shell, the Bowser shell, which is no longer a special item, heart, which is no longer a special item, Kirby mallet, which yeah, is- Yeah, that, that was a spoiler alert, Kirby is a DLC character. Yeah. I mean, the Kirby Mallet isn't a DLC, but, um, anyways, so basically it's going to be like the potted piranha plant, and you got to try and smash enemies in your path. The Super Horn, Ice Flower, which freezes people. The Fire Flower, Feather, which is no longer a battle mode exclusive. And it, I'm not sure if it's going to be as broken as the one in Super Mario Kart. Nope. And Gl plus, and plus we're going to bring Gliding back. Oh yeah, that's right, we will. Uh, ba Gold Mushroom, Ba Bomb. The Radical Nine, which will be we will be explaining which items will go in the Radical Nine. Yeah, we already have the Lucky Seven and Crazy Eight, and, and the we'll Radical Nine sounds good. And we'll be deciding which, uh, you know, mm. items will go in the Radical we Nine. We have the Gold Flower from New Super Mario Bros. Two. It's a Fire Flower, but with a bigger blast radius. Frog Suit. Cappy, which will be which will replace the Boomerang Flower. Yeah. Pow Block. Bubble. Brown, brown shell, which is similar to the fireballs in Double Dash, except with shells. Clover, which gives you luck. Like, if you get a clover and get an item box in first or second place, it'll give you, like, an item if you get in, like, 11th or 12th place. Uh, cloud, which basically lets you fly along a gap. And water bucket, bucket, which basically means you can toss it at the person in front of you, and it, he will spin out of control. And we will explain how every single special item works. But we will not spoil the characters. Try and guess which special items go to which character in the comments below. So first off, we have the fireball, similar to one from Double Dash. We have the crown, which basically when you hit someone with it, it freezes them in place. The life mushroom, which gives you uh, invincibility for three hits. Uh, Vanish Cap, which basically is the boo, except you don't get an item. The Cursed Key, which is similar to the boo, uh, but uh, basically you get it, and if you throw it on an enemy, uh, Fanta will come and take away their item. No, Fanta will strike them down, kind of like the uh, Lightning Cloud, and basically you get an item. It's like the Heart and the Lightning Cloud together. Basically, yeah, so. and and also I forgot to me I forgot to mention we are back. We're going to do double carts. Oh yeah, we're doing characters from Double Dash because Double Dash is the only card with te not a technical sequel. Yeah, uh, all yeah, right. like yeah, like the sequels. Like there was S Super Mario Kart, Mario Kart Super Circuit, uh, uh, Mario Kart Wii, and Mario Kart Eight. Mario Kart D DS and Mario Kart um uh, seven. seven and Mario Kart sixty four. And Mario Kart Tour, because that is the most N64 tracks. And so, Double Dash does not have a sequel. A really, and, and Double Dash is a really good game, so... Yeah, yeah, I, I've ne I never played it before, but it's my dream to play it. It's, it's, I've seen it too, it's really good. So we have the Egg, Mega Much, which is coming back, and it's now a special item. The Shell Cannon, Banana Barrel, the Missile, which is basically, uh, it, basically a homing bob bomb the pounder, which basically means you throw the, the pounder crate, which means you throw the crate and anyone near it will spin out of control. Uh, the giant banana, missile bill, which is basically kind of like the normal missile, except with a bigger blast radius. Uh, the bullet bill, which is now a special item. Uh, the chain chomp is like, is not a special item, but the bullet bill is. 
um, the paintbrush, which basically you splash it three times on a track and whoever touches the paint will spin out of control. The dry shell, which lets you invulnerable to like lava or lava balls for like four seconds. Um, the giant ball, which is basically just something to bounce you out of the way. Mechanical arms, which is a new one, which basically means you can like uh, punch people in your way for a couple of hits. Uh, the arrow, which lets you fast forward a couple of seconds. The ring, which is kind of like a disc that you throw and you have like five or six of them. The banana bunch, which is now a special item. A wand, which lets you shoot like a couple of projectiles or maybe let you turn like obstacles like crates or walls into enemies. Um, the lucky seven, which makes a return now. All right, Joe, you want to read the rest? Yeah, the lucky seven, boomerang, um, the wings, bob bomb cannon. Wait, wait, we gotta explain. The boomerang flower, which the wings, which lets you go a little bit faster without having to spam the trigger like a gold mushroom. All right, Joe. Um, we have the uh, bob bomb cannon. Okay. Giant hammer. But you get three of them. To throw. Super crown. Okay. Um, a flower. Which basically lets you stop time. Like if you throw it at someone, they go in slow motion. Super bow. Which is kind of like the tanuki suit, except you claw in front instead of the back. Sp spiny egg. Which is kind of like the Bowser shell, except it squishes people down instead of hitting them. Yeah. Clock. Which stops time for two seconds. Yeah, clock. Wrench, which is kind of like, which is basically the boomerang flower. Uh, it's basically, yeah, it's basically the boomerang flower. And Bonsai, Cappy. Bonsai Bill. Um, which is, Bonsai Bill is a new item. It's a bullet bill. It goes faster, but it lasts a shorter amount of time. Uh, spike ball? Which is basically the spiny egg, except it's, the spiny egg homes in on you, but the spike ball doesn't. Rainbow shell. Which is basically a shell that basically hits. If you throw it, it hits, like, say you're in sixth place, it'll hit the first and in fifth place, fourth place, and third place. But if someone bumps into you, then the shell breaks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? Okay. All there right, so we have the Poltergeist 3,000 and 5,000. Mm -hmm. the, th the 3,000. No, you get the 5,000 if you're in 12th within 7th and 12th place, and you get the 3,000 if you're in 3rd um, and 6th place, and it basically mm -hmm. sucks people up. The 5,000 lets you suck up 5 players, the 3,000 lets you suck up 3. Okay. The power pellet. Yeah. Makes you giant. Again, kind of like the mini mush, except you literally kill players. Like, they go back to 12th yeah. place. Yeah. Dash shoes. Yeah. We're not gonna oh, I like the big dash. Propeller, which is kind of like the Tanuki suit, except you could hit 360 degrees. Yeah. <laughs> the Master Sword, which basically lets you hit from side to side. Yeah. The bolt, <laughs> The boulder, except which is basically an egg, except it doesn't drop items. The Power Spin, which lets you... Uh, it's a... Mm, I can't really explain it, because it kind of spoils the characters, but I'll explain it in the characters video. Or if I'm there, the zap bomb, which is a ball bomb, except it electrocutes people, shrinking you down small. Yes. What are you doing? <laughs> the blaster, which lets you shoot, you know, people for like ten seconds. Uh, the rocket, which is very similar to the missile, except it doesn't blow up and merely like hits an enemy. The lightning cloud, which makes a return, sadly. But I mean, we just want that. The fire, which is kind of like the spicy curry yeah. in Super Smash Bros. Okay. That spams fire. The teleport, which lets you teleport to any place. You could get lucky and get first place, or you could be really unlucky and get twelve, get to twelfth place, or you could get in any other place. Um, I can't, I can't. The pokeball, which is basically a project. It's just a projectile. The boxing glove, um, which. Basically lets you punch people. And after it hits a first place player, it disappears. Yeah. Uh, the staff, which lets you... It's uh, very similar to the... Uh, uh, what's it called? Very similar to... 
Uh, the ice block. The staff, which lets you hit the, you know, the players in front of you again. Okay. The except ice it block? does. Except it doesn't break the, the ice, ice block. You throw a giant ice block, which basically hits people. Dual blaster. It's just it's basically the blaster, but you shoot two of them. Yeah. <laughs> Stop. Give all right, so that's the end of this video. Yeah, stay tuned for part four, which is gonna be the DLC and retro tracks. And and remember to try and comment down below which items that you think will go with each character, and we will you'll see at the final part. All right, bye guys, and tell Joe to stop acting like an idiot.